Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm glad you are here today. We are going to see how to do an iris flower. And there are six ways that I will show you this time. And we start by coming out with our needle and then inserting back very close to the point where you came out. You decide the size of the flower that you want to make and then if it happened to you uh, that it, the ribbon is twisted just do like me with your fingers give the right direction that you want to get then you come out from the back and go the needle with the needle through the hole and insert your needle back. Now you come out from the center of what it is now, the first part of our flower. And we are going to do the straight stitch. Remember always you can fix the ribbon in the direction that you want to get. Also you can use the needle to fix the ribbon every time. Once again we come out from the center and this time we are going to do the stitch in the left side. Here it is, our first flower, Iris Black. For our second flower, and the second way to make the Iris, we are going to repeat the same stitch that we did in the first one.
The difference will be the petals that we are going to form in the bottom. We are going to come out from the center, but this time we are going to do the Japanese stitch. You can find the tutorial that I have is in the um, in the top of the screen. You will find the icon. You can click. And here we are doing it is um, don't forget to let the ribbon a little loose and then insert in the center of the white of your ribbon going over it. Don't pull too strongly. Now we come back um, to come out from the center. We are going to repeat the same stitch now in the center. With your needle, you can give the form and kind of volume to your stitch. This um, way to let your ribbon a little loose give to the flower a touch of natural and reality way is not flat and it looks really really pretty. We come back again from the center and then this time is in the left side where we are going to form our other petal. Once again, let your ribbon loose and insert your ribbon, your needle, sorry, over your ribbon. Here you have two ways to do the iris flower. Don't miss the second part of this tutorial. There are three and I see you very soon.